Hey folks, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix FaceTime screen black or dim while FaceTime video calling on iPhone after iOS update. Solution 1 is check your internet connection. Sometimes your FaceTime screen goes black or dim when you have poor internet connection. Whether you are using Wi-Fi or cellular data, it should be fast. To increase the internet speed, turn off and turn on Wi-Fi, cellular data and Wi-Fi router. Solution 2 is make sure that you selected video call. Sometimes we all made this mistake which we select audio call instead of selecting video call. That's the reason we see the black screen when using FaceTime. Make sure that you selected video call. Solution 3 is restart your iPhone and try again. Launch settings app on your iPhone. Next, tap on general. Scroll down the screen to bottom and tap on shutdown. Next, drag the slide to power off slider to turn off. Wait for 30 seconds and turn on your device again. Solution 4 is check the camera lens. Make sure that you and your caller are not blocking the camera lens. Solution 5 is post restart. If you are using iPhone 8 and later models, then do the following steps. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 plus then do the following steps. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until you are getting the Apple logo on your iPhone screen. If you are using iPhone 6s plus and earlier models then do the following steps. Press and hold the home button and side button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. Solution 6 is Reset Network Settings. Open Settings app on your iPhone. Then find and tap on General. Next, tap on Reset at bottom. Select Reset Network Settings. Now enter the passcode if need. Again tap on reset network settings to confirm this process. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.